Hey, what's happening, everyone? Welcome to my channel. My name is Ronald. All right. So today I'm going to walk you through how you can turn your Facebook friend who are pretty much a stranger to you right now, and you can turn these people into your best friend really quick. Now, what it means is that Think about it. If you're an affiliate marketer or maybe you're a coach or maybe you're a course creator, maybe you're a consultant utilizing Facebook platform as your business, then building your audience is the must. OK, that's where everything starts. That is where you uh, generate leads and you turn them into your uh, sales in the end. It's really must to do that. So then how can you do it really quickly without you burning out? And but also at the same time, you can automate it. So I'm going to walk you through today how you can do uh, do this a very simple and easy steps where you can build a relationship with your audience a lot quicker. So they're going to start at uh, having some attention about you and they're going to consume your content over and over again. So you can actually uh, generate leads and turn into their sales and uh, really quickly. All right. So before we get into it, make sure to uh, subscribe to my channel and give some thumbs up and I'll appreciate that. So think about it, guys. I know if you are using Facebook platform to build your business right now, the first thing that you have to do is you have to really focus on building your audience, all right? Audience means people are actually interacting with your content. It could be giving a likes or comments or share. That is what we call the engagement. But thing is, how many out of your uh, friends right now are actually interacting with you? And how many friends do you have in your friend list, all right? It's really important. I mean, well, there are many different ways we can actually do this uh, in, in like make multiple way of doing this, all right? There's no right and wrong answer. But today I'm going to show you something that's very simple, that's very quick. Because all we want is, think about it. Why do you think people are using paid ads? Because paid ads is a lot faster, right? Show your offer to front of like 1,000, 10,000 people really quick, but you got to spend some money on it, right? But as an organic marketer, it takes little time to build the audience. Because think about it, who is going to see your offer? If if stranger, people who doesn't know you yet, what you stand for, what you do, right? Then these when you put your offers out, these people are go, just going to ignore your offer. They are not going to look at it. Then who is the people you're actually trying to present your offer? Is your audience. Because your audience are potential prospects. They are not buyer yet, but they will become buyer. Once they start consuming your content and then uh, build a relationship and then they start trusting you, liking you, and that's where they uh, start uh, paying attention to what you, what you have to offer. But problem is it takes very long time if you just putting out the content only, all right? So that's why we kind of shorten our period to build a relationship a lot quicker. Only way is conversation. Now, that is why we all use Messenger, right? Messenger is like number one uh, a method that we actually uh, incorporate in our business to actually build a relationship faster to actually close sales. So then how can you do that without a stranger? Let me ask you guys, how many friends do you have in your Facebook friend right now? I know if you're here for maybe uh, six months or maybe a year, then you will have probably more than 1,000 friends or maybe 3,000 or maybe 6, 000, uh, 5,000. That's the maximum friend you can have. But here's the thing though, how many people are you having conversation with? Are you out of maybe maybe are you having a like if, if you have 1000 friend list right now, did you have a conversation with about 50 percent of your friend list or 500 people? I don't think so. Think about that. Then how can you actually uh, start conversation really easily without being salesy, without spamming them? How can you do that? I will show you today step by step how you can actually uh, start having a, a conversation with these people. Very easy way. Also, you can autopilot it so you don't need to waste your time. So I'm going to go into uh, Facebook, my Facebook account, and I will show you how it's done. So um, let me let me uh, share, share the, uh, Facebook, OK? All right, so I'm going to share the Facebook right now. Okay, let me go, oh, sorry about that guys. Let me share it, okay. Um, all right, now I'm going to uh, share the screen with you right now. Um, let's see, sorry about that guys. All right, so I'm going to share the screen with you guys. Right, so right now, this is my actual uh, account, 
uh, Facebook account. And I want to show you really something cool. Now, in Facebook organic marketing, the first step is, I mean, well, any, any social media platform, we, when we are doing organic marketing, the first thing that we have to do is we have to build the audience to drive traffic, right? Then how can we do that? Well, there are many methods we do. I mean, you can just literally um, put out your content over and over again to build a relationship and then and, and, and build audience. But sometimes just putting out your content, it takes a lot of time because when we are starting out, even though you're expert in something, it doesn't mean you're a content creator. It's a very different thing. It takes time to cultivate that, how to write a really good content. So then how can we incorporate many different uh, methods to actually build your audience and start making a relationship really quicker so you can actually make sales really faster? So then that is why Facebook is the most, most one of the best platform you can actually run your business because we know where they are hanging around. So um, actually you can, you know, having a friend list, for example, uh, right now, um, um, right now I have about uh, 3,000, uh, 3.1 K uh, friend list right now. Uh, but you have to understand that um, when you post something, uh, Facebook is algorithm. I mean, even though you post something, it doesn't mean that lots of people are going to see your content it doesn't happen that way all right they show to people who are very close to you or they are people who are always interacting with you or you're they are already in your friend list all right and that's how the facebook actually show your content over and over again and once the engagement grows then uh, engagement means people are commenting on your content uh, uh sharing or commenting or, or giving hearts something like that we call the engagement once the engagement grows you will have you can actually uh you will have chance to uh, go you know take your content go to vital but it doesn't happen all the time so then how can you do that easily well as i said there are tons of ways of doing it but i'll show you the very simple way now what you can do is first thing that we usually do is when when we come to uh, facebook the first thing we do is we have i mean facebook is the best play platform because we know where your are uh, where your target audience are hanging around yeah they're all in groups right so if you see me here right uh for example i'm gonna go into uh yeah we can uh, we can just search for the group for example diet right maybe keto diet right keto diet right if i type this in i will see a tons of group right now which you can join okay once you join any of the groups, right now, uh, my niche is making money online, especially uh, course creators or coaches or um, affiliate marketing space. So uh, if I go back to um, my groups, which I joined, and you will see that there are tons of the group that related to my target audience, okay? It's really good. But, I mean, Facebook is, we already know where target audience hang around. You don't need to uh, wandering around where you have to find your target audience. We know it already in Facebook platform. So all we need to do is find the group where people are having exact same interest as what you are having right now in your business, and then go there and join the group. Uh, my recommendation is always private group, guys, okay? When you join the private groups, uh, for example, like I'm going to go into uh, one of the group. It's for the, um, yeah, for example, like legendary marketer, right? This is the uh, this is the group. And what you can do is when you when you come into other people's group, uh, just go into the members, right? If you go to members, you can actually see people right here, okay? New to the group, right? All these people are here now. The first thing that you have to do is, uh, for example, like, you know, if you see here, add friend, add friend, add friend, add friend, add friend, right? That is right. You can add friend and you can you can actually request a friend to these all these people, right? These people, I don't know who they are yet, but I need to grow my audience who could be my, who could become my potential prospect in the future. So we know where they're hanging around. You think about it. If these people are in this group, that means they have exact same interest as what I have right now, right? Affiliate marketing. Then what I'm going to do is I usually, you can do this manually. Just click, click, click like, like, like this, right? Sometimes you cannot add friends because uh, if you have any relation like mutual friends or anything like that, uh, Facebook is not going to allow you to uh, request a friend. So sometimes it's going to block it. So you can do this manually like this. Click, 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 right? Click, click, click like this. Or you can use automation tool. For me, I don't want to waste my time doing this. So 
um, I use a, a, a tool like this to actually uh, automate it. So for example, I'm just gonna click run, right? Then if you see here, it automatically actually requests friend to all these people who are in who are who has uh, exact same interest as what I have right now. Now, once I keep requesting friend to these people, if somebody accept my friend request, they become my friend list, right? So for now, I'm gonna stop it. I'm just showing you the uh, demonstration right now. So once I uh, add this request a friend to these people, some people might ignore, some people might decline, but some people will accept my friend request. So then these people will have higher chance to con start consuming my contents. Then just consuming my content, is it gonna build my relationship? Well, it can, but it's gonna take time. So I want to shorten that time so I can actually uh, turn these people and build a relationship a lot faster. So I can, so they, they will have more uh, um, like, uh, you know, I want them to ready to see my offer, okay? Think about it. We put our offer in the social media to make uh, to make sales, right? Then how can we build a relationship really quickly? So we can turn these people into my really good friend who, who likes me, who trusts me, and that's when they actually get ready to see my offer. So what I'm doing is, um, so if I go to, uh, uh, let's see, Let's see where is it right here. If you if you go to your uh, 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 dashboard in your uh, homepage in your Facebook, you will see friends. When you click the friends, do you see birthday? If I click the birthday, now all my Facebook friend who became my friend, I know when their birthdays are. Okay, now you can actually do this manually. All right. You can actually go through this tab birthday and every single day or maybe once a week you can come here and you can just send them a message like hey matthew uh happy birthday it's your birthday today uh have an amazing day with your family yeah you can send the message directly or you can just go into their uh profile and, and drop the uh, post about saying that hey happy birthday cheryl happy birthday uh area happy birthday Lee. yeah you can do that manually too but as i said well i don't really do that Okay, then why are we sending a birthday wish to these people? Think about it. What could be the best way to have a conversation with your Facebook friends? Well, you if you, you I mean, you a lot of people actually, we call it DM marketing. You, you can just send out them a, 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 a like cold DM. We call it cold DM directly to these people. Then sometimes people feel like it's a, it's a spamming, all right? Then it's really hard to uh, continue our conversation to build a relationship. It's not easy and you will get burned out. So... What we are leveraging here is we are leveraging people's birthday and we are sending out a birthday wish, right? Look, everyone loves birthday wish. They thank for it, all right? So they appreciate that. I will show you the example today, all right? So that is where we can continue our conversation really easily, okay? And, okay, we, and we can also follow up them too. Now, you can do it manually. So now do you see the fast way to actually build a relationship with your Facebook stranger, even though they, they, be, they accept my friend request and even though they became my friend, it doesn't mean they know me, they like me. No, it's not because we never had any conversation ever before. Even though these people might see my content and consume my content, but it doesn't mean they like me. I don't know yet because we never had any conversation. So we utilize people's birthday. That is why Facebook is awesome platform to start with, even though it's very, it's very beginner friendly, guys, okay? So I utilize people's birthday to actually start having conversation. Look, everyone has their birthday. Look, May 18th, uh, May 8th, 18th, we, we already, I already, these people are already birthday today. Today is May 18th right now. Tomorrow have about one, two, three, four, five, six people are birthday on May, May 19th, tomorrow. Now, I can send these people a uh, birthday wish over and over again really quick, okay? Uh, today's, oh, uh, sorry, sorry about that. Today's May, May 20th. Oh, uh, yeah, tomorrow, upcoming birthday. Do you see it? Upcoming birthday? Yeah, we know that. Now, you can do this manually or uh, you can do you can actually autopilot it. For me, I don't waste my time uh, doing all manual. So, I will show you how I do that. So, I'm using this software, birthday wisher, and then... Uh, what I'm doing is the first thing that we do is uh, we go to settings and then we create uh, a message segments. Segments means uh, when we wish up, we, when we wish them their birthday, 
uh, we can also send uh, posting uh, with birthday wish their uh, their profile. We can also send them direct message to these uh, my Facebook friends because once you become a friends, when you send out the DM, it no longer go into spam because we are friend now. They will see their right into their inbox in messenger inbox, and they will see my uh, uh, my messages. All right about greeting messages for the, their birthday. Yeah, so we created a uh, different about two to two, two maybe three to five a uh, different variations because. Even though we are using a bot right here, right now, CRM bot, um, I don't want uh, Facebook to know that I'm using a bot. So we utilize a different templates and it's gonna random, randomly send out the messages. Like, so it's gonna act like a human being. So Facebook doesn't know that. It's really cool. So uh, if you see here, I have a, a different segments, greeting, a uh, 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 birthday greeting on that day and a birthday greeting a day before. Yeah, you can actually create many different variations. And also I can create a uh, create different images for the post and then I can schedule it when it should uh, post it or uh, their birthday thing right and then once I set this up now I can go into home and then I can just click this right uh, once I enable it right and then once I make a post right and send the message once you click this and also you can actually uh, uh, send a message based on the gender. It's pretty cool, but for me, I like uh, unisex, uh, you know, in universal messages. So I'm using that right now. And then I choose the what kind of message segment, that, the group that I'm using uh, to send their uh, DMs. And I choose that one and save. And then once it's done, it's going to automatically uh, start sending them uh, uh, greeting messages over and over again every single day to all the people who are birthday in my Facebook friend list. All right. So for now, I'm going to uh, disable it for now. And I will show you what I've done. So if I go into my tab right now, um, say for example, here, do you see this? Uh, uh, okay, this is another um, CRM that I'm using to organize my messenger, right? I will, I will make that video next time. But for today, we are talking about birthday wish because I'm utilizing people's birthday to build a relationship really quick to make them as my good friend. So or uh, maybe, you know, I maybe they need something, they need help, then I can we can talk about it, then I can offer them something, then we turn them into buy really quick. So that is the whole process here. So what I'm doing here is uh, like person like this, if you see here, she got the message like uh, a couple, about, about like 30 minutes ago. Hello, uh, Shannis, we have been Facebook friend for quite some time, but we never had a chance to have some uh, conversation. So I decided to say happy birthday, enjoy your day. Now, I send this person happy birthday wish birthday, right? Now I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna give a tag, happy birthday, because I'm organizing this because um, I want to know who is the people that I had a uh, birthday wish to. So uh, I can actually keep having conversation with them later on. Now, if you check their profile, right? I'm gonna scroll down a little bit. Do you see here, Ronald Shin? Happy birthday, Shannon Langston. Happy to be your best friend, let's go. I can actually personalize your name and all that. Pretty cool, right? Yes, I send them their message and I can just give her right here. So now she's a birthday. And let's check it out another person, right? And I'm gonna come here. Yeah, uh, yeah, people start talking to me like this, right? Hey, you are, uh, do you see this? Uh, I send this person, hey, uh, Michael, you, uh, we have a fixed friend, enjoy your birthday, right? And he said, oh, thank you, Mr. Sheen, I'm uh, uh, eternally grateful. And I said, hey, you are very welcome. I'll have an amazing time with your family and chat soon. Sure, pretty cool, right? So this is how we turn our conversation really quick without being salesy, without uh, becoming a spammer or anything like that. So, and also this person too, right? Uh, this person was actually, we. I sent a message here, but I sent a message too. Hey, what's up, Chandra? Happy birthday. Enjoy your time with your family. Now, I can also give this guy tag for happy birthday, right? And let's go into another one. And I'm going to come here. See, even though I didn't do it manually, uh, all this red tag is uh, I'm greeting people birthday, all right? Same as this person too. See, what's up, Hector? Happy birthday. Enjoy your time with the family. Thank you, bro. And I say, you are welcome, and your weekend with your family. Now I'm gonna uh, send, I, I can talk to these people later on uh, much more in convenient way and comfortable way because I'm not a spammer anymore. I wish them a, uh, I wish them a birthday, okay? That is a very, very easy and fast way to build a relationship without becoming a spammer, all right? And then we slowly have a conversation later on. So if you see here all the tags, right? 
uh, this person also, I said, happy birthday, happy birthday, yeah, like, like Tiffany, right? Thank you, right? Hey, Tiffany, happy birthday, enjoy your time with your family. Thank you, you are welcome, right? Now, we are actually, so now I'm using this kind of CRM to organize my DMs, and I will, I will, I will put all the uh, information in, in the, in the below the description. You guys can check it out. So what I'm doing is I'm utilizing, uh, we call it a messenger um, CRM like this. So I'm organizing uh, people who are uh, who people who are having I'm, I'm conversation with, and I'm organizing by the tags. So I don't need to scroll down to look for it. But anyway, um, so now do you see how I'm actually organizing and managing my business all together and all on autopilot? So it, it actually, once I apply this method automations in my business, um, I have more time freedom, guys. Okay, I don't waste my time anymore, and I also it's very organized. Okay, my business doesn't become an, uh, like a, you know doing guesswork anymore. It's very predictable, and I know what I have to do every single day. I know who I, who I have to follow up, blah blah, right, and so on and so on. So anyway, so this is how we do things. So do you see now? I'm utilizing um like I'm gonna go into uh, my, my 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 profile. So I'm gonna uh, stop share. Sorry about that. Okay, so what I want to uh, convey today is that, you know, there are many different ways we can build a relationship quicker, right? But first thing is content. Obviously, there's no way easy way. Content is where everything starts. But just utilizing content is not going to help you to build a relationship, build your audience quicker to uh, start build your business, making sales. No, it's, it's, it takes time, right? It takes time. Then how can you really build a relationship with your audience or at the same time? They know you more. They like you more. So you can offer them something later on really quicker. That's right. Conversation has to be there all the time. DM is hard to But utilizing this method, your DM is no longer cold DM. It's no longer spamming. You can have very easy conversation really quick. We can find out what they are doing in their business. Because I already know what they are doing. Because I request a friend to them in the private Facebook group where we have hang where we are where we are hanging around together people who have the same interest right so we know exactly who they are what they want just trying to build a relationship that's it so we can talk about the business i want to find out what they want what they need and then i offer them whatever they need and we can talk about it so that is how we build a relationship a lot quicker utilizing people's birthday i hope you know that you know i hope you understood what i showed you today so utilize Facebook platform, especially birthday, is another best way to actually build a relationship and turn your uh, Facebook friend, stranger, into your best friend and turn them into your buyer at the same time. It's a really good tool and good way of doing things, all right? So as I said, you can do it manually or you can do the, uh, you can use, utilize a CRM that I was showing to you today to actually automate all your business. So uh, thank you for watching this video. All the this, uh, all the informations are below the description. You guys can check it out, and we have a special promo for that. So all those links are very special promos. You guys can check it out. And if you have any uh, questions, just drop me a, your comment below, and then I will get back to ASF really quick. All right. So thank you so much. And please, if you are you are utilizing Facebook platform, please always make sure that growing your audience is first thing that you have to focus on. But at the same time, if you can utilize this birthday people's birthday into your business, incorporate that properly, then you don't need to waste your time thinking about why people are not coming into my offer, why people are not engaging with my content, so on, so on. You don't have to do that anymore. No more guesswork, okay? It's all strategy, all right? So uh, I hope you understood it, and then I, I, will, I, will, I will make another video about showing you uh, all different uh, software that I'm using right now. Uh, you can check it out. Uh, once you subscribe to my channel, you will get notified notifications of my future videos. So thank you so much. And then I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye-bye.